Guys, good morning. Uh, we are getting ready to take Cashy to school, and we are uh, hopefully going to go test today. But uh, it's a little interesting morning here in West Virginia. We got we got snow, so I hope that it is still warm in North Carolina. Um, I hope we'll see. But we are uh, we're going to try and get some testing in before eight way cash days on saturday we'll see this is not normal for me but we gonna try so let's get to it and uh hopefully i'll see you guys at the racetrack what do you think yeah all right let's see what we can do all right guys we are here we are here at wilkesboro dragway cars unloaded uh, we're gonna put a little bit more heat in it and then see what we can do we are uh, hoping to get at least two good test passes if I get more than that then it's just a, a plus but what do you think we got to get this guy home because he's got school tomorrow well, not used to going to on Thursdays but uh, we're gonna try it huh I got out of the 30 degrees in snow to come down here so Unfortunately, there was a break. A uh, stick shift car broke, and so we're waiting on it to get moved. Then we'll have a couple cars in front of us, and then we're going to make us ourselves a test hit. Uh, turn the RPM down. Um, we got the air pressure the same. Tune-up is very similar, and we are just going to see. It's cold. It's like high 40, low 50s. If it's 50, I'll be really surprised here. And um, track is cold. Not a lot of, uh, of people going down it. So hopefully we can get ourselves a nice test pass here. Uh, turn the RPMs down to 3,900 from 41. And that, that usually tames the car down pretty good. So we'll see, probably we'll make about five pounds of boost, maybe something like that. It depends. Um, it's, the air's really cold, so it may do good. I don't know, we're, we're testing things out. I did not tighten the front end up. Um, I'm gonna let it ride the way it is with the surface being marginal at best. It is not going to be near as sticky as Shady Side this last go around. So let's see what we can do. Let's get it.
all right don't hate the hair but uh got our time slip obviously didn't make a full hit uh 60 foot was all we got out of it what'd you think it was it went immediate it was right amazing besides that turn on the right yeah side. i don't know exactly why it made a really immediate turn to the right so uh it could have been anything um honestly 60 foot was not bad which i don't really care we can divulge times that was a 130 60 foot which is not bad consider we dropped it down and uh i'm not displeased with that Let's see if i can show you all right we're gonna see it can you see it 130 60 foot it's about the weirdest 770 pass i've ever made but uh not bad not bad at all um so we're gonna check everything over real quick and uh go up for another lick see what we can do all right guys second test hit we drop tire or no we up tire pressure about a pound uh turn the launch boost down a little bit and the rpm down just a little bit and we tighten it up one and click hopefully this will get us a nice solid pass but we'll see i'm hoping for a nine i'm hoping for a lot faster than that 10 how was 10 faster than or slow faster than nine a six <laughs> now we need low fives oh god yeah What are you even doing? We ran out of fuel. M1 problems. Real smart. Ran and out of fuel. Metal. Yeah, and the sheet metal fell off. You're gonna have to take that stuff back to me. Back to the truck. So all right. Bang bang a skid skid.
so that pass was interesting to say the least. Uh, we did have a 130 60 foot and then something happened and I was like, what in the world's going on? Well, right here is what's going on. Look at this. Woo. It's loose, completely loose. And that's my fault, I should have checked that. This one, also loose. I think it's where I pulled them off last time. I didn't check them. So, uh, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to get under this and clean all that up. And I don't, cause I don't wanna risk. I knew that it felt odd during the pass. It, it lost the tire where it doesn't normally lose it. And uh, that's probably our reason why right there. So, cause it just spewed oil out everywhere. So, all right, let's uh, clean this thing up. See what we right, guys. So, as you can see, we, so our changes did not work. Uh, tightening the front end. Let's see if I can show you here. Front shock, 2.4 inches, three. It took forever for that shock to fully extend. So it did great in that aspect, but the track will just not take that right now. So it just won't do it. Will not do it. But this here, this you can see drive shaft data, it's way up. And then we had a, we had a big spike there at the end. It got a little sketchy because of the fluids getting under the wheels. So we do have some baselines though. So let's get to it. All right, guys. So um, we're sad to say. Well, the the track's just going away. It's a it's no, there's nobody going down it. So, um, which I mean, good for no prep. We have we know where we need to go back to. Um, we definitely got to check everything over tomorrow and on Saturday morning. Check everything over, which the uh, the oil pressure dropped on the hitting the brakes. So I'm probably going to need to put a little bit more oil in this thing and. Um, Yep, that's that's pretty much it. Stop, man. This guy. This guy. Yeah, I know that the door squeaks. That's enough. It's old. All right. So, what do you think? Do you like H Wilkesboro? If I would have bought my four-wheeler, I would have went on the oh, four-wheeler track. Of course you would. Of course you would. All right. I don't know. Do you want to eat Mexican? Heck you want to yeah. see if it's open? Yeah. All right. So. Birds. All right. We got this cleaned off a little bit. Um, we're gonna have to put some more oomph on these and uh, yeah so hopefully you guys enjoy that a little sketchy um, it's just a very it's very 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 slick out there right now car lost the tire immediately and uh, just couldn't recover um, which I did go up on the pressure and so I'm sure that we can make this work uh, this Saturday um, for sure so all right guys let's uh, let's get this thing loaded up Mexican. What do you think? Pretty good. Tasty. Yeah, the chips are really good. Alright guys, so that's gonna be it for this video testing. We know what not to do now and we can only go up from here. So we'll see what the uh, track looks like Saturday and go from there. Alright, peace. For the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to grow then it's done for you. For the record, lab on me going all the way. For the record, ain't trying to link no time to waste. For the record, for the record, for the record.